Today we're going to be going over the installation procedures between a polymer semi-auto trigger group and a metal housing semi-auto trigger group. Um, there are different ways to install these trigger groups, so we're just going to go over how each one is done on a 91 firearm. The polymer lower is very easy to install. You just slide these little ears over the semi-auto shelf at an angle. You rotate it up, slide it on, push it forward, wrap on the stop, make sure it's lined up, lock in the push pin, and you're set. The metal housings are a little bit trickier to install than the polymer ones. They don't have ears to slide over the semi-auto shelf, so you have to kind of force it up against the receiver and down. Uh, and it does take a little bit of work to finagle it on there. And you want to keep pressure up against the receiver like this and force it down just like that. So it lines up. Uh, at this point you're good, except for there's a little bit of a gap between this uh, bottom tang and the receiver. Uh, at this point you'll actually use your back plate on your stock to kind of catch it at the bottom like this, catch it and try to move it up and then you slap on the stock, push in the push pin and there you go. And line it up with the receiver so you just kind of apply pressure to the bottom of the stock, get it to slide over, 